welcome back to our survival let's play on no man's land for what i think is episode 81 you'll have seen a couple of really short time lapses um just sort of intro on into the video of uh us taking wood up to our production site we've ended up with we're on real time for a start let's take that off we've ended up with loads so we have to 40, nearly 47,000, we probably were at 47,000 at one point. Um, which takes ages to chew through. And then convert it into planks to then send to the sawmill. Obviously you can see we're only just starting to um, get off sort of top whack for the planks. That's because, I think it was in the last episode, we... We changed the output, didn't we? So that we could um, we could sell the planks, which is what we're going to do now. Well, I say that's what we're going to do now. We're going to try to do that. I've got, I think on here, there's two full trees. So I'm just going to say how much we get. Because we've still got a ton of trees. And if we get a decent amount for it, I might... Why is that not so? Ah, it's not the help window I want. Ah, it's that. Do I need to press this? So, I mean, that wasn't overly much, was it? Three grand? A full trailer there would have been about nine grand. Um, I mean, I say it wasn't much. It's uh, considering what you spend for the pallets, what you pay for the pallets. It's like it is a lot, isn't it? It's just it takes so much time to do it. What we need, though, before we can start looking at selling them planks, we need a weight, like. A heavy one as well so we're gonna to have to invest in a good size weight uh, that's the one we've got at the minute um, I want double that really I mean that one and a half ton there I think one and a half ton might be all right I don't know what these are how much Oh, it says at the bottom, so that's half a ton. 650. Um, there was a one that I've seen, actually. Where is it? It's a, that's another homemade one. One and a half ton, I like that. For 1500. There, this one here. I think this is what we're going to go for. Self made weight. Um, two ton, well, over two tons. Let's try this for nine hundred pound. I don't know if I'll be able to hook a trailer to it, like. And hopefully this just <laughs> this doesn't make me tractor flip forward. Right, can we hook a trailer to it as well? Ah, oh, brilliant. I mean, I love that. That looks brilliant. Now let's see if we can pick up these planks. We'll take the interactive markers off. I mean, because with the with the uh, weight that we've got, the 650 kilogram weight, it just wasn't anywhere near. I mean, it wasn't even close to being able to pick them up. I'm still not overly convinced that our tractor is going to be big enough to do it now, to be honest. And what I need to do really is push the planks out. Because you can see there's a decent size um, dip there. Right. 
Let's see. This will pick up. I mean, it looks like it's going to, if... If the pallet force system worked, how it should. I mean... <sighs> when are we going to fix this, people? I mean, look at that. This is going to go flying, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, so the weight's heavy enough. Um, how I'm going to get them on? There's something else. I won't even pick it up. I, <laughs> I don't know what else to try. Um, give us two secs. Okay, so I've been had a look at some options, um, and basically the option that pretty much the only option that we can go for at the minute we can't afford anywhere. We're a little bit shy, um, and that's this. I'll show you. Unless there's a p no, I was going to say unless there's suddenly a park lift in here. Um, the thing that we will be going for, which will make at least one viewer very happy is going to be this I think because this I think is going to be the only th pretty much the only thing that's going to allow us to um, pick it up because there's just two I mean those are just nigh and useless um, you can see we've got and by the way, I can't put the tractor anywhere near them because it just flips my tractor over as well. So, great times. Um, so we've got two there, three, four, five, six we'll have. But like I said, at the minute, we haven't got the funds to buy them unless I go and sell them. Could do that, couldn't I? And then go and load them up. Price still going up for them. Um, planks, 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 planks. Um, so the only place I can sell it is the farm shop, and the price is still going up. I don't mind selling it at that because then it'll give us a little bit of money ready for next. Um, next episode when we're hopefully going to be getting a, a good chunk of money in um, right what we'll do is I will get as many of these loaders up as I can I know normally I've been using the box trailer for this but seeing as this trailer's up here I might as well just carry on using this. I don't mind that it's going to be mixed with oats either. Um, I'll get these loaded up and we'll be back to sell them. Right, I've got this trailer stacked. What I've actually done now is, you'll see that there's still sort of 4,000 litres worth of um, soy drink that would just carry on producing. Both the soy drink and the oat drink I've now changed to sell directly. It's going to be a bit of an experiment and by all means if you know it's going to be different then tell us but my thinking was there isn't much difference between um, the price of either of them whether they're at the highest or the lowest it's quite a consistent price so by my reasoning which doesn't mean it's right um, there won't be that much of a fluctuation so if we sell them directly 
we won't have to mess about um, doing all the loading and we should still get a pretty consistent price now that's the theory behind it whether that's going to be the reality or not I don't know right you can see though we've got 12 and a half grand which means we can afford to get what we want um, let's get that off there and we'll go up and get our new item um, I want to get this done quite sharpish because I would like to get in this in-game day the grass cut I don't think I'll get a cut and wind road but I want to cut because then in the second half of the month we've got um, we've got all the grass to get collected and we've got a field to turn around um, probably more fertilising to do Right, front load of tools. Here it is. Um, if we change colour, are we going to... I'll just keep it as that. Um, right, 8,000. We'll buy that. No, I've never used this. I never used this sort of equipment in 19 as well I know obviously the um, sort of basic concept of it but it might take a while to get the hang of it I know when I watched um, a couple of different sort of YouTubers on 19 they used to use this a, a lot um, in particular I remember Mr Sealy P he had a, one in particular didn't he that he used all the time instead of um, instead of uh, pallet forks or the like right so let's get this down here there we go right it is going to lift it so we are right for weight, although it is light. You can see it's lifting a little bit. But it works. It works. Fantastic. I feel like there's going to be quite a big I told you so in the comments and you know who I'm referring to oh didn't like that didn't like that didn't like that get back down I mean that is it's over two ton weight that we've got on the back however It's two and a half ton of planks, but you'd have still thought that the the tractor itself would have uh, accounted for some weight, wouldn't you? And if I can pick it up this way, this might distribute the weight a little bit better. wrong about that I 
I mean, with the with the state that pallet forks are in on this game, I think uh, I think this might be the way ahead. To be honest. I mean, Pallet Fork's an absolute mess, aren't it? I know every now and again it sort of that subject comes up, but they're so poor. Now I'm worried about those ones on the side. I'm worried that as soon as I hook up to them, it'll send the tractor spinning. Get around this side, we'll get on the level because as you can see, there's quite a big drop off there. Oh, it's alright, it's not bad at all. I mean, still very light, but it didn't shoot me tractor up into the air, which is what I was half expecting. Get back down, you. What I'll probably do as well is I'll probably, if I haven't already, I don't know if I did. Um, I'll have a look once I've finish this but I'll probably set it back to um, distributing it just selling these gives us a chance to sort of clear the decks because we've built up so many planks um, that the furniture shop just the carpentry just can't use it just it's not quick enough Let's just sort this one out first and then we'll we'll sort that. This is gonna be mega heavy as well, isn't it? It's also not gonna go on. Get on there. There you go. Right, let's get these strapped before they change the mind. Excellent. Right, we're going to get them sold straight away. In fact, before I do, I'll just go on to. So you can see they're on selling now. Uh, let's go up here. Planks. Let's set it back to that. I'm going to take this in a quite a wide turn because this will, given any chance this will tip. I mean, what have we got on here? Uh, 5, 10, 15 tonnes worth on here. Uh, 
and the tractor is now failing it as well. I mean, that is pretty much all we're going to get. We ain't getting any higher than that. And we're about to hit a bank as well. I mean, look at the back wheels there. Not the back wheels of the tractor, the back wheels of the trailer. Can't really see, can you? Just keep moving, you're nearly there. Nearly there. Oh, don't say I'm going to have to go back and get the McCormick. There we go. So this, I'm seeing, is pretty much free money to be honest, because it's stuff we've had saved up for a long time. Oh, that's going to be so annoying. Right, so 15,400, and then we've still got that one. That'll sell now. And 3,080 for that. So. We finish on 23 grand. I am more than happy with that. Because that, those planks are being sat there for probably a couple of in game years, to be honest, because we just keep creating them. And we just, because of that, they're constantly full. Jar you know, could I even set them back to a. Uh, I could even. I'm going to I'm going to set them back to storing because it's going to be ages until we use all that wood up in the in the carpentry. Um so why not? Yeah, we'll do that. Right. Let's go and get in a McCormick. Um I want to get this grass cut before the next in game day. Right. So front or on with I'll get the rear mower away. You can see the there's the clearing that we've made from them trees. Um, those are just the end cuts, like the sort of the stumps. Um, I find it easier to cut that way. Right, 30 mile an hour. Not a problem. Put the lights on because it's just starting to get that bit dark, isn't it? It's October and four o'clock. If I can get a cut today, then it means Indian game day tomorrow. It'll just need rowing and um, collecting, and obviously it's the collecting that takes the the time, isn't it? I mean that's doing that fine. We've got more than enough power with this setup. Um, we we're alright on the feet, to be honest. It was, uh, it was just the feet that obviously got stuck in that sort of limp mode all the time, didn't it? That was the pain with that. It just means when we can afford to, we'll upgrade as well. Um, whether we upgrade to a butterfly more or, or what, I don't know yet. I 
Right, we haven't had a time lapse yet, have we? In this episode? I don't think we've had time lapse in this episode. So, we'll get it on time lapse. Um, obviously, it won't cover much. The time lapse I try to keep sort of below a minute. Um, we'll get it on time lapse. We'll do this field, we'll move into the next one, and we'll come back. Right, we're not going to get into the second field. Um, it's just going to be too dark. Even in this, so half an hour's passed, hasn't it, since we started? And you can see it's just how dark it's getting now. Um, I've never liked the videos in the dark. They just, I think I used to do it on Greenland's every now and again, and it just wasn't, uh, it wasn't great. So we'll get this finished, and then we'll get packed up for the night, I think. And then, we're only one day away, one in-game day away from hopefully making a massive chunk of money with our eggs and our, um, our oil. that up get that up and that is going to be it um, I'll just check make sure we've got enough food for the cows to go into the next day but I think we will I don't think there'll be an issue um, yeah I think we use around about 3,000 litres of TMR deer, I think. So yeah, more than enough. Okie doke, um, we've made money today, but we've also had to spend some, which was a bit of a shame, but it's one of them things, I suppose. Bit of kit I didn't really want to have to buy. That um, The bag lifter. However, I think in the long run, it is definitely going to make life easier. Um, but yeah, we'll leave it there. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you again in the next one.